G'day, it's Rob here again. Well, like everyone, I've got a toolbox full of tools, and uh, in the top section, I've got a whole bunch of the smaller size tools, uh, little spanner sets, and torque drivers and I've got a quarter inch sockets up here I've got a lot of half inch drives you know I've got a big one inch set up the farm as well but the little quarter inch drives are quite a handy sort of set to have because quite often you're only working on small stuff and they're a lot more compact and they get into stuff a lot better this is your standard sort of grip Here's another one. And here's a long extension bar I made up with a grip on the end. Put a cross bar in it. And then you've got various extension bars here. And uh, yeah, short ones, long ones. And anyway, I can either use the cross bar on it like that. T bar like that or the little ratchet head and this is just a little cheapo ratchet head you know it's the usual sort of thing you, whoops you turn the end and change direction yeah it's, just, yeah, it's all right it's a bit stiff but it's not a very expensive one anyway I was in um, a store down the road from me the other day you know, looking at all the stuff they had for sale, it's a place, a place near me I've been meaning to go to for a long time and finally got in there. It's an import place and anyone in South Australia, yeah, it's a good place to go and have a look at because their prices are good and they've got some quite good quality gear in there. Anyway, I'll show you what I bought, which is, I think, a better quality unit than this. They have, they have ones like this with the swivel head, you know what I mean, like this ratchet head has a swivel point here and the bar can pivot in or out so it can come in on an angle but quite often these are too long they get in the way if you're working in close you know uh, I mean you could put a big long extension bar on it and work it that way but you know, I'll show you what I bought and I thought it was pretty damn good check this out so here's my drives which I showed you just a minute ago and you get these plasticky headwinds, which are, they're okay, they're good to grip, but they're not very, <laughs> very well made. They're pretty light duty, I think. So I made up this one, you know, it's a good heavy one, and uh, just bronze brazed it up, and that works a treat. And then this one here is a good little one in a set. It uh, talks drivers and also the little sockets. And uh, you can use that, you know, that way or that way. It's, it's quite good. And here's a big mother I made up. And I made it so that you just put an extension bar in as a, as a, as a crossbar. And, uh, yeah, once again, easy to make. Anyway, I'll show you the, the new one I bought, which, yeah, is good. So here's your regular sized uh, ratchet you know, bar, reversible, and you can get longer ones, and you can get little short ones, you know, round, they're okay, anyway, check this out, I bought this, and it's, it's beautifully made, like it's, it's really, really well made, and it's patent, got a patent uh, thing on it, so, I hadn't seen one like this before with flat on it like that and it's really 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 well made impressive and you just slide that across and change direction but it's better because you can get into really confined spaces with that and you can still get quite a bit of leverage on because bearing in mind you're only using you know small sizes there's going to be a huge torque on them you know it could be computer cases or something like that. Anyway, yeah, 
There's something for you to keep your eyes open for. This was $9.15, which I think is a good price for what it is. It's, it is, yeah, really, really well made and, uh, yeah, got a good click on head with a ball, you know, with a ball in it, in the shaft. So it holds the stuff good and tight and, uh, Then you can just put the extension bar on it as well. How good is that, guys? Eh? Isn't that pretty good? I, I like it a lot. I think it's fantastic. they got a whole range of quarters in stuff there. And, uh, yeah, quite classy. Much much better than this uh, ratchet drive. You know, really well-made ones with pivoting heads and all the rest. And they were good. I was tempted to buy one of those as well, but... Seeing that, I thought that was great. Now this mob is called RBS Australia, importers and wholesalers, and they're uh, they're in Kegworth Road, Melrose Park. They're just down by um, opposite Castle Plaza for anyone that's in South Australia. And they used to advertise on Gumtree. Um, that's where I first spotted them, and I've been meaning to go there for ages, and uh, finally got, got the chance to drop in, and I can only say that it's worth a visit. They've got some really nice tooling there. Um, I'm not getting any sponsorship out of this whatsoever. I'm just mentioning this. It's, uh, it's something that I, I thought was super good. And, yeah, if you're into the quarter-inch drive stuff, you want something better, better than that, which is pretty basic, and more compact than that, but, you know, would still give you good leverage, enough to talk up things to the level that you really want to do. Yeah, I think this is a top, top little bit of gear. We're coming close on it. Yeah, so there you go. But there, the finish is super good. Really nice. You know, everything's nice and tight and precise. Okay, well that's just a quick one for you. It's, uh, yeah, it's something I think is worth checking out if you're down my way. And uh, I looked online to see what other versions there were like this and I couldn't really see anything out there. There was little round bar ones, but I mean... I like this with the flat, so I think that's good. You can really get a good purchase on that. And, yeah. And, you know, yeah. All right, that's it for me. Uh, well, what can I say? I think it's a good buy. Okay, catch you later. Cheers.